some people in Maldives have been polluting the minds of Maldivian people. China has played an important, uh, significant role in doing this. It was not only doing that, it has been generally providing all the assistance to the conservative elements. When Maldives was just, just became independent in 1965. From then on, today till today, there have been some hiccups, all right, but the bilateral relationship, despite the new regime, I think it's a very strong partnership. In this yes, 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 of course, of course. Whenever uh, such developments happen, uh, and, you know, it's, it's, even though you see it as uh, kind of a one-off development, uh, some people in Maldives have been polluting the minds of Maldivian people. And China has played an important, uh, significant role in doing this. And it has not only doing that, it has been generally providing all the assistance to the conservative elements uh, in Maldives. And uh, the current regime in Maldives is certainly not, I would say they're, they're perhaps pro-development, but they're also very, very conservative. There is an Islamic tilt to their policies. And, you know, that's why you see that uh, they visited uh, Turkey. Uh, the first visit of uh, President Muizu was to Turkey. And uh, it's very unfortunate that even the second visit was uh, to China. So this is an indication that uh, what the new regime is preferring. But as they settle down, they would realize that with, without India, it's, it's going to be extremely difficult for Maldives to navigate uh, through their domestic issues, through their issues related to climate change, uh, you know, day-to-day -day requirements, chahe ho, uh, aata ho, ya alu ho, piaz ho, ya river sand ho. Maldives is extremely uh, dependent on India, and India has been providing this, uh, you know, by going out of its way for decades now, 1976 onwards. Then 1988, we all know about it. So India, as in fact today the Maldivian uh, tourism industry also has issued a, note, a release saying that India is uh, the first responder and our closest neighbor. So uh, now the reactions are coming from Maldivian citizens who know the depth of this relationship, who know how multidimensional this is and how India has every time without fail been the first to respond to Maldivian crisis. That's our own sovereign territory, and uh, you know it's it's very good that Prime Minister is uh, promoting Lakshadweep as a you know a tourist uh, destination. It's unspoiled, very virgin uh, and beautiful uh, islands, extremely beautiful blue uh, shining waters. So it's, it's our jewel uh, in terms of tourism, in terms of people. They are very nice, uh, peaceful. And uh, I, I think it's, it's, it was high time that uh, the political figures, as high as the Honorable Prime Minister, that level, has taken interest in promoting tourism.